from what I've got on my grown people dems. Uh, so this is for my Patreon Sarita, uh, who won the Jump the Queue prize draw last week. Uh, and she's keeping us in the Smith and Thel lane. And actually, I'm really glad about it. Um, I don't think I'm getting many views <laughs> uh, of these reactions on YouTube, but I think, well, when I started this channel, it was all about like, for you guys too, but also for me. <laughs> um, so I can actually learn and just discover new things and like broaden my horizons and stuff. And I think I said in my last video of this one that like Smith and Thel, especially once I went back to listen to it for a second time, because I think the first time, because there were no lyrics up, um, I kind of missed, I think, some, some key points of the video. And when I went back and I, and I kind of like listened to it again with the lyrics, I was like, this is amazing. Like, it's actually amazing. Like, so for me, it's three for three. Like, Sarita's so like, come up with three tracks from this group. And each of those tracks, I'm like, yo, this is sick. Um, so I'm happy to uh, like react to this and, and upload it. And hopefully someone else will see it somewhere and be like, do you know what? I didn't, I didn't know about this group either. Um, so yeah, thank you, Sarita. This one is called Goliath. Um, again, I'm going to hope we've got some lyrics, captions attached to the video, um, but if not, I'm going to try and just listen, like, really intently. <laughs> Do you know what? Yeah, 
These guys have always got something to say. Do you know? And, and I think this is what I think is really, really awesome because I think, like I said in my last video, indie isn't necessarily my my go-to ever. Like I would never choose to usually put like an indie song on. Um, but when I'm confronted with that, like some either I've gone somewhere or I'm out with friends or there's a concert and there's about whatever, like I'm confronted with with an indie style level of music, like um, I, there are some things that I will probably tune out a little bit too, but. Um, I try and find something within it that's 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 qualitative to my ear. So whether it might be the melody, or it might be um, the the you know the harmony of the of the instruments that are being used, or the texture of the person's voice, or the message that they're singing about, or uh, often it can be a combination of all of them. And I think for Smith and Thel, for me, it is definitely a combination of all of them. I love her voice. I love how she kind of how she puts the bars in, the verses, the choruses. I love when he then comes in, so I love how they sound together. Um, like, and even like that, that kind of like fast kind of guitar kind of sound, like it's, it's cool. Like, I, as I said, it's, it's, they're, they're not a band that I, I ever would have heard of and probably just put on, just to put on. But I think having this channel has kind of, again, confronted me to it and, you know, required that I listen to it. And I'm just so glad that I have. Like, the, the, this one was such a cool message and such a relevant message in 2023. Like, for so many reasons, which I won't go into now because there's so much... Um, the, the, the world is just very crazy right now. Um, and I think, you know, being, being brave and standing up to things that seem bigger than yourself, um, I think there's a lot of that that a lot of us can take, do you know what I mean? In, and, and actually, you can probably put that into many different guises, whether it's a, a personal battle with something, whether it's a, you know, relationship crisis, whether it's, you know, again, the world cray-cray, like, there are so many different guises in which someone can, well, can be standing on the head of a giant, do you know what I mean? Like, and actually being like, do you know what, no, 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 do you know what, I might feel like I'm really, really small, um, but I can make a difference, like, I can make a difference, just put that one little small foot in front of the other little small foot and just keep doing that to then, you know, be like, I'm a giant, do you know what I mean? So that's a really awesome, like, positive uh, and impactful tune. Um, the video I thought was quite cool as well, um, especially because the majority of it was, like, on this particular, obviously, like, different parts of, of that drawing, whether it was the carriage or the person with the flag or one with the ears or um I've never really seen anyone being like um pulled by a rhino before. So that's new. Um but then when it zoomed out and then actually they were in the wheelbarrow of a giant, I'm like, that is that is that is really cool. Like, you're toiling away like and not actually even like noticing that like there's a whole bigger picture behind you. Um or maybe you do realise, maybe that's the point. Um so I thought that was quite cool. Um yeah, I, I just I just I always end up leaving one of these reactions going, that was cool, man. <laughs> that was really cool. So, yeah, thank you, Sarita. Um, and uh, even if it's just you and I that are watching them, I'm all right with that. I'm fine with that. I'm fine. Um, but if you did happen to watch this and you did enjoy this, then do let me know what your thoughts were. Like, what did you what did you take away from it? Like, And if you are a fan of Smith & Fell, like, are there any other songs that you think uh, would be worthwhile listening to or any other... I guess bands that you think might be quite similar to, to these guys are good and have got like a sick message as well. Um, yeah, Wicked, I really enjoyed that. So yeah, if you did enjoy that with me, then please drop me a like and subscribe. That would be really, really cool of you. Um, and I also do have a, well, I've got just started a, a YouTube uh, membership as well. Um, just to make it probably a little bit more like cost effective for some people who maybe didn't want to jump over to Patreon. Um, and with that, you can get like, these cool badges that you can see here, so it kind of can show how long you've been part of the, the a part of my of my channel for, uh, and it also gives you the perk that um, when I see your comments within my videos and stuff, I can see that you're part of the membership and I can respond to you guys a bit quicker. Um, and of course, though, I do have my Patreon where you get access to stuff before it comes to YouTube, um, more access to me. <laughs> um, and it's just a fantastic way to help support uh, me and the channel so um, so yeah lots of options for you there um, but for now thank you so much for watching with me and uh, I hope to see you on the next one <laughs>